back of the murders, Friends for Life, 2013 production. During a TV appearance about her new book, Erica Falk is asked about her influences for writing murder mystery stories. Erica mentions her childhood best friend Peter, who encouraged her to put down in written form her storytelling from those years ago. Erica's friend Peter, it transpires though, could well be the focal point of a tale of mystery in itself as it arises that he left home and disappeared at the age of just 14 and Erica was the last person it seems to have seen him. The TV broadcast stirs up memories from the past and has Erica wondering once more where Peter is in the present day. An old school reunion has Erica and police husband Patrick back in contact with friends from those early days but also knew Peter and it turns out that Peter's brother still lives in Fjallbaka along with their sister who is living under an assumed identity to protect her from abusive ex-husband. Once again the events of the past catch up in the present of Fjallbaka and when people connected to Peter at the time of his disappearance turn up dead Questions are asked about what really happened and is Peter dead or returned for some vengeful purpose. Friends for Life moves along at a well-constructed pace and events unravel with purposeful intrigue. Death by misadventure, a youthful pact and a crime of pride all knock at the investigative door of Erica and Patrick, this time with a far greater resonating personal effect. The truth behind what really happened to Peter reveals itself with dramatic conclusion that makes this one of the strong entries in the Fjallbaka murder film series, delivering a rewarding 5.5 out of 10 viewing experience. This one again is a 1 85 to 1 shot aspect ratio with a very good 169 TV friendly presentation. And once again, the picture is bright and clear with very well rendered English subtitles to the original Swedish language soundtrack. Do please let us know in the comments below what your thoughts are on the Fjallbaka murders, if you've seen any of the episodes and what your favourite might be, or if you have any questions perhaps about it. But otherwise please do check on right back here at the Geek Legion of Doom for all entries and reviews in the six series films that are the Fjallbaka murders. Thanks for watching. Bye for now. Buckaroo Banzai is pure nutty fun. Okay.